Good morning. morning. We were just listening to Garth Brooks. Well, uh, you were. Sorry, I was just listening to Garth Brooks. Uh, weather-wise today, it's actually not going to be a bad day. There will be some rain and some mist and drizzle in places this morning uh, and a few isolated showers, but there will be a couple of sunny spells break through um, a little bit later on into the afternoon and top temperatures today are 14 to 16 degrees. I'm just up. I know. I can't lie. <laughs> I just woke up at 20 minutes ago. I slept in this morning, so I'm sorry, but I'll be grand by 7. I've got 10 minutes to get about two cups of coffee into me really quickly. Uh, trending overnight, uh, Fats Domino. He's mm. passed away at the age of 89. Uh, a lot of tributes being paid to him uh, last night on social media. Uh, Ain't that a shame, Blueberry Hill. Mm. I was reading about him this Love morning. Blueberry Hill. Yeah, it's yeah. gorgeous. Uh, between 1955 and 1960, only Elvis surpassed Fats Domino in terms of chart hits. Wow, I didn't know that. Yeah, I mean, I knew he was successful, but I didn't realise he was that successful. So we'll play a Fats Domino song on the show this morning. Let us know what you'd like to hear. Um, uh, the repeal of the Eighth Committee is obviously trending this morning. That's in the papers too. Brian, Dub- uh, Brian Dobson did his last 6-1. Mm-hmm. I was watching. Yeah. yeah, so he's switching to mornings, yeah? Yeah, he's uh, he's going to be competing with us, so we don't like you, Dabo. If you're watching, we don't. We never like to. We like him. We like him. We do him. like him. What a legend, uh, in fairness. So congratulations to him. And uh, it's World Pumpkin Day. Yes. Yeah. yeah. It's, I, I I knew that that was a thing before Halloween because people would assume, oh yeah, that's Halloween, but it's not. It's the 26th every year, I think. Yeah. I I'm, I, I like the look of them. I wouldn't be mad for eating them. I've never tasted one, to be honest. Ah, uh, listen, it's not great. <laughs> I've I've made a couple of pumpkin pies. Pumpkin soup, maybe. I suppose you could put. I think I might have actually had that. You could kind of spice it up a bit, maybe. Maybe. Just maybe. a squash, like. I have to go and buy one today. Uh, or to, yeah, it'll be today because um, I have no Halloween stuff up yet. Okay. And all my neighbours, I'm the only one in my little cul-de-sac that oh, doesn't have right. any Halloween stuff up Don't yet. Don't be put to shame now over that. I, I know. Uh, I, we're in our second pumpkin because I made a huge mistake with our first pumpkin. I left it beside the fire. Ah, so when all soft and squishy. Yeah, and it's 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 he- it's went really scary looking. Its head kind of collapsed in on itself. I just walked in one morning and I looked, I was like, ah! What the hell is that? But it was just a melting pumpkin. Uh, don't do that. I tend to make mine terrible every year. As in, you know, you know you're carving. No, as in, I'm just really bad at it. Oh, so people like, are really good so at it. I, I make the eyes pure wonky. One is smaller than the other. The <laughs> nose tends to be like the size of an eye and it's always yeah. really bad. So. Yeah, no, ours are pretty crap. So yeah. But it's good crack at the same time. Yeah. Uh, papers today on the 26th, the Irish Times this morning says government defers action against banks. More about the tracker mortgage scandal there this morning. And super bugs leading to avoidable are leading to avoidable deaths, according to the paper this morning as well. Uh, the HSE, according to the examiner as well this morning, are ready for a, a flu outbreak uh, if, if people need to visit the hospital. I think they say that every year anyway. Uh, also on the front pages of the papers this morning, this is a mad story. Did you hear, hear this about the GA club? No. So this crowd won the Intermediate Hurling Championship, St. Patrick's GA in, um, in Kilkenny. Mm-hmm. And to celebrate, they ordered strippers. And now the GA club have had to come out and say, it was a private event, it was nothing to do with us. A, but let's just say the photographs and the videos that are going around social media, Aww. because of course everyone pulled out their phone, of course. are not flattering. And it's it's bad. It's a bad look on not just the club, but the GEA. Mm. Flattering to the strippers, though, probably. Uh, yeah, probably. Um, I haven't seen them. But story. What, what paper is that in? That's in the Examiner, the Independent, and the Mirror. They all have it today. The Mirror okay. actually have um, the, the blacked out pixelated pictures. God. So for research purposes, we better go and have a look. Yeah. Um, that's in, in a lot of the papers this morning as well. And uh, just very quick look at the Independent as well. They say Brexit surge will see our population shoot up by 1.1 million. Uh, I think that's wow. down to the fact that people will be going for Irish passports, isn't it? And that's the yeah. thing. So, okay. yeah. uh, we've got Zane and Sia on the show Music Wise today. We've got Taylor Swift. Look what you made me do. I'm loving it now. Are you loving it? I'm loving it. She's uh, speaking of uh, naked ladies. She's nude in her new video. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. research as well. Research, yeah. And uh, all these as well. M people coming up on the show. I'm out of love. Oh, Set oh, no, me. That's Anastasia. Oh yeah, sorry. Yeah. Uh, one of our favorites and the Proclaimers. Nice one. Spanish Although, lads. Lost with them at the wheel of anything recently. Still Did not you? over it. A little bit bitter. Okay, Proclaimers coming up between right. now and nine o'clock this morning. Get in touch. Oh eight three three hundred three three hundred. Have a good day. Good morning. Morning.